These small mechanical parts are known as standoffs or pillars. They are typically used to attach thin plates to other parts. They can typically be seen on printed circuit boards, such as those used in computers or other electronics. This type of standoffs can be found in two different materials, metallic or plastic. Regarding their shape these can be female-female or male-female. There are two methods to use these parts, depending on the type of standoff chosen. First it is necessary to have the surface where the plate will be placed, with their respective holes. In the case of the male-female type, these require placing screws at one end, to later place the plate in place and fix it with nuts. In the second case, the procedure is basically the same, however, instead of fixing the plate with nuts, you need to make use of another pair of screws. How can a standoff be properly chosen? First it is necessary to choose the diameter of the screw or gap of the standoff. For example, if the diameter is 3 mm, which is the same for the male side as a female, the name of the standoff will start as M3. In case of being 4 mm, its name will begin with M4. Since both the male and female sides are of the same diameter, two M3 standoffs can be screwed together. Regarding their length, most standoffs measure 6 mm in the section with rope or screwable. The rest of the body can be chosen according to its length, which is also measured in millimeters. Therefore, the names for the standoffs shown would be as follows. In this case an M3 screw and nut would be compatible with any of these standoffs, since the diameter is the same in all three. In the description of this video, you will find the link where you can buy this type of pieces online.